Participants, please log into your terminals now. Simulated trial test has been conducted as of day one, June 15, 2075, 1800 hours. Commencing day two, real time allocation. By unbiased pre selection, player C selected as first player, second player, player B, final player, player A. Commencing day two in three, two, one. I thought about what you said yesterday. And? I'm in. Great. There's a condition, though, if we both want this to work. What? I thought about what you said yesterday. And? I'm not sure about it. Why not? It's a sweet deal. I'll win the land for both of us. I'll give you whatever you need after. And this my turn. No thanks. I can do this myself. Lucky you, starting first. It really doesn't matter, you know. It does matter, it's not a try anymore. It's still a game. I'm not planning to die. Who says you're going to? Going back to the real world is a death sentence to me. <clears throat> okay, so you'll have to miss your turn. What? Get out of here. You're joking, right? No. It's the only way we can win. <laughs> She's not that smart, you know? Who? Oh! oh. Uh, Player C. Hello. Be right back. Hi. Yes, she's not that smart. You know, I don't need to miss a turn. Back. So, if C is not that smart, why do you need me? You can't beat her yourself. It's not about her. It's about the system. You know I don't care about winning and I know you're smarter than that. We'll all have to die one way or another. It's inevitable. That's an easy thing to say. If you're not afraid to die, then why are you here? I didn't say I wasn't afraid. It could be big what we're doing here. It could save mankind. Do you really think this could work? What they are trying to do? I'd like to think so. What if it doesn't? Then at least I know I tried to do something to survive. It's not about A not being smart. It's about me being better at this and Oh, and I'm the one who's not smart? No. That's not what I meant. What I mean is... What you mean is you want to steal my land from me. Not your land yet. <laughs> Why are you here? What? If you want some boxes, I mean lands, I need to know why you're here. Same reason we all are. The world's fucked. And we're all so desperate we're willing to put ourselves through this fucked up citizenship test. Because it's the only chance we get at a do-over. Okay. What about you? Why are you here? Get to leave on somehow? On my own terms. Come on, just give me your turn. I'll win the land for us. Oh, and I'm the god of the universe. So, what do you think? You in? I'm not sure. You! Excuse me! Sorry! Fuck you! <laughs> the problem with the world today is that there's too much information, not enough understanding or empathy. At least that's what I told her. We'd been chatting for a few months. So then she says, if you could build your perfect world, what would it be? 
I say easy. Social and economic equality, lots of trees, vegetarianism for all. She laughs. Well, actually, she LOLs. <laughs> what? I say. That's very noble and idealistic. You think I'm stupid. No, I don't. Okay, naive. I don't hear anything back for like five minutes. <laughs> what about you? What would your perfect world be? Sorry, she says bathroom break. All good. So, what would your perfect world be? She says, I don't believe in dreaming about it. What do you mean? I believe in actions, doing something about it. You want that perfect world, you have to make it yourself. And how do you do that? You fight. Are you in the military or something? You can say so. I'm part of a movement that does what? You're too young for this kid. I'm not a kid. How old did you say you were? 23. Very funny. Didn't you say you were 18? No! Okay, fine. Yes, okay. But I'm mature. <laughs> she LOLs again and then nothing. Are you one of those liberation front people? Silence. Hello? I say. Then she says, do you think what we're doing is wrong? So you are one of those liberation front people. We're not terrorists, you know, she says. You know me by now, you can tell. I'm a human being just like you. I know, I say. Only difference is I put my life on the line. She was cool, a friend, you know? She'd write me letters, send me gifts, teach me a thing or two I didn't know, like a sister I never had. So then I say, can you tell me more? Player B, land a lot. Good move, thanks. I was almost shot. I can still hear it, ringing in my ears and everything around me slow. That moment I saw the bullet whirring at me, then I felt a body slamming me to the side. These are not unusual, the assassination attempts. They are not unusual. This was my fifth. And every time before that, I remember thinking, please, dear God, you don't want to die. This time, I thought about my shoes. Gucci, Chanel, Blenix, Jimmy shoes. Please, dear God, keep them safe. I just wish someone would make a museum out of them and name it after me in my memory. Because this time I knew it was real. I would never step foot into this house again, never rule over a country ever again. The ringing then turned into a staccato whirring of a helicopter. Tick, 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 Get in, Shannon! I run. I've got quite good running as a little. But believe me, when you run for your life, Kristen Louboutins aren't quite the right fit. But even then, one must always exit in style. Fuck the shoes! Get in! They only have roulette! Fuck the shoes! Then I hear it again, but this was not the gunshot, something way heavier. And I see the ground shifting and his mouth moving slowly. Fuck the shoes! At least this is what I think he's saying. I cannot hear him. And then I feel the underside of my bare feet being sliced by rubble. Don't remember when I took off my Louboutins. I'm in the helicopter. Tower is a speck in Smithfields. You're okay. We are going to be okay. We're going past the border and we'll seek asylum there. And I open my eyes and I see them. The last of my Louboutins. And cold tears start to strip down my face. Player A, land a lot.
Thanks. My pleasure. Don't call me a refugee. My country was not sunk by bombs. It just sunk. We knew it would happen one day. I just didn't imagine it would be in my lifetime. When people hear the word refugee, they think people in desperation, leaving their homes, walking huge distances, living in squalid camps. My family didn't take huge leaps. We weren't in distress. We just took our time and plotted our escape route. One tidal surge, and we moved across to another city. Another one, and we moved again. We'd be safe for a couple of years, and then a cyclone. It's like that game no one plays anymore. Snakes and ladders. My mother had a dream one night. She dreamt we were children again, my siblings and I, and we were at the swimming pool. One by one we'd jump in, but we'd never get back up. So that's how she decided. We had to leave home for good. It's a sign, she said. My mother was not a superstitious woman, but she always trusted her gut. And you remember Kiribati, the Pacific Island? It was the first to sink. That was 50 years ago. There were others later on, and still people chose to cling to their land because they think it's where they belong. My country was not an island. It was big enough. And that's why we believed it would never happen to us. Our land could take the hit. It was strong. We were strong. But when the weather eats you alive, you learn to let go of that notion. Ten years after we left, my country was swallowed whole. Yes, you see many of my people here now. But the difference between a refugee and a migrant is choice and time. So I'm not a refugee, I'm a migrant. And the difference between you and me is that you'd like to shut one eye and think you can live forever. You think you're entitled to live on this land just because you're a citizen. Plan C, land allotted. Phase one complete. Participants, please log off from your terminals. Yeah, uh, we're Square One Collective. We all live in New York now, but we're from 
all over. I'm from Metro Detroit originally. I'm Sarah. I'm Andrea. I'm from Singapore. I'm Juliana. I'm from Brazil. And we actually have uh, two other company members, Akshay Gandhi and Sally Kingsford, who couldn't make it out here, but they are.